This video will show a Kalmar Casadero laser system being installed. In just over two minutes, you will see the laser system assembled, turned on, and come up to full power. We start with the main components on a cart as they come out of the box. The laser is easy to install. The laser controller weighs 13.6 kilograms, but because the laser head weighs 27.3 kilograms, William gets some help from George in moving and positioning the head from the cart onto the demonstration table. Once the key components are in place, William begins attaching the three cables which connect the power supply and the laser head. Two are data lines and the third is an RF connection. As with any laser installation, it is important to ensure the installation is reviewed by your company's laser safety officer to make certain that you are compliant with all standards and practices outlined for the safe use of lasers. The output of the Casadero laser has a wavelength of 1,030 nanometers and a maximum pulse energy of 30 microjoules at 100 kilohertz repetition rate. In this example, we placed a sealed tube from the laser output to a power meter for demonstration purposes. Because the Casadero is a fiber laser and designed for low maintenance, once installed, the laser requires no adjustments, no diode tuning, no gas recharging, no filter, desiccant or coolant replacement, no harmonic crystal shifting, no realignment, little preventive maintenance, and no human intervention. Finally, we plug in the main power and switch the unit on. And as easy as that, the installation is complete. No special tools, complicated startup sequences, or special alignment procedures are required. The display on the power meter shows how quickly the system comes up to full power after it is switched on. So, that's the installation of the Casadero Femtosecond laser from Calmar.